Handicapper Steve here, handicapping the racing from Sandown Park here on Friday. It is the 2nd of July, 2021. Going to look at the stakes races on the program from Sandown. But before I get on to that, remember to please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Get 5 for more selections for race courses around the world. Uh, but uh, let's look at the stakes action here on Sandown's program. We're looking at the 2nd and 4th race, 255 and the 405. The second race of 2.55, it is the Coral Marathon. It's illicit stakes for Class 1 horses, going for a purse $61,000. Race for 4-year-olds and upwards. Only 6 horses, but it's a quality group of 6 horses, going 3,200 meters or 2 miles over the turf course. As a top selection here, we're going to go take the number 5 horse, the Grand Visor. We'll go 5-4-2 in the Tri-Cash Trifecta. 5-4-2, Tri-Cash Trifecta. Top selection of 5 horse, the Grand Visor. There's several Gelden by Frankel, Richard Kingscoats on this one for Eden Williams. The horse is most recent he came 19th of June at Ascot, two miles three quarters in the Queen Alexandra Stakes, and the um, horse finished third by three and three quarter lengths. It was staying the trip well, kind of hit the wall a little bit late, but it, there was nothing bad about that race. But definitely cutting back to six off the quick turnaround of nearly less than two weeks, I think he's sitting on a lot better run. Two back in the group, th uh, group two pre Volcom Tessie Vigier at La Champ, mile seven eighths, 24th of May. He finished third by eight lengths. The two in front of him were just much better horse, and he just got outclassed by him by them, but he stayed the trip well. And then prior to that, Chester, two miles to rates in a class two handicap, drawn very wide with a high weight. He finished second by two lengths. He was staying well, but Falcon 8 just had the extra rockets to win that day. And then prior to that at uh, Sheldon, uh, two miles, five eights in the grade two. Ballymore Novices Hurdle in November. He finished 14th by 16 lengths. And, you know, he ran okay. He jumped a decent race, but there was nothing, anything spectacular uh, to call home about. Uh, and then prior to that, Ponte Frack, two miles and a quarter in a class two conditions race, finishing second by nine, nine lengths. Again, he stayed the trip while on the sludgy going. He's going to see a little given the ground, but not as hard as he saw um, as he saw last year at Doncaster in that Doncaster Cup cup where he finished third but uh coming here today at six one let's give him a shot but to recap my selection for the 255 the second race from sand down it is the coral marathon let's take the five horse the grand visor we'll go five four two in the tri cash trifecta the fourth race, 405, it's featured Gala Stakes. It's listed stakes for Class 1 horses, going for per $61,000. Race for three year olds and upwards. Five horses are going 2,000 meters or a mile and a quarter on the turf course. We're going to take the four horse here, John Leeper, as a top selection. We'll go 431 in the Tri Cash Trifecta. 431 Tri Cash Trifecta. Top selection of four horse, the Leeper, or John Leeper. The Strio Colt by Frankel. Adam Kirby gets them out for Ed Dunlop. The horse is most recent out. He came the 5th of June at Epsom, a mile and a half in the Kazoo Derby, or the Kazoo Derby, and uh, he's drawn very wide, and just did not run, he finished ninth by uh, 20 lengths, and, uh, you know, he, he just completely just crumbled, cutting back to a mile and a quarter, much lesser quality of horses, he's sitting on a better run, two back in the list of six at Newmarket, a mile and a quarter, 15th of May, he won by one quarter lengths, and basically had his dream trip, he stalked all the way around, quickened up nicely, and got the job done, an all-around easy race, and then prior to that, in late in April at, New, at Newcastle, Castle, mile quarter, and a class by a novice on the tapita. He was running a little bit wide, but he still got the job done, winning by four lengths. A very easy, easy coasting away victory. Um, but um, like I said, stepping down in class, stepping down in trip at seven to five, he's a very likely winner. So let's use him here to recap my selection for the 405, the fourth race from Sandown. It is the Yala Stakes. Let's take the four horse, John Leeper. We'll go 431 in the Tri Cash Trifecta. So good luck to all. Please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kit 5. Good luck, everybody.